You can transform grass by sliding them, stretching them or reflecting them. You can do all three either vertically or horizontally. In these examples we call the original graph y equals fx, which is just a way of saying a graph with some random equation. In the beginning I'm going to concentrate on just the vertical kinds of transformation because once you get them the horizontal stuff is just the opposite. Now if we take an equation of a graph and add something to it, call it a, it will go up a units. If a is a negative number it will go down a units. The quick explanation is that if you add say 10 to the end of an equation then the y value will be increased by 10 because y equals all this stuff. So all the y coordinates will go up 10. You can also times the function this fx stuff which stretches or squeezes the graph. Obviously if you times it by a big number it gets bigger, times it by a small number less than 1 it will get smaller. Lastly, if you put a minus in front of the function, the y values are just going to be the opposite of what they were in the beginning, so it will basically flip the graph. You get vertical transformations when you're doing stuff outside the function, like here. The opposite is when you do stuff inside the function, inside this bracket, which transforms graphs horizontally. So in this column, we're changing fx outside the function like this plus a, this times a and this minus and in this column we're changing fx inside the function or inside the bracket like this times a inside bracket minus inside bracket. It's important to realize that when doing stuff inside the bracket you do the opposite of the change like if plus a then go minus a in the x direction if I have a minus a, I go in the plus direction. If I times by a, then I divide or squeeze the graph by a factor of a. But here, you just reflect, don't do the opposite. Finally, you might have noticed this already, when transforming vertically the center of enlargement here and the mirror line here are the x-axis. And you can guess they are the y-axis here.